Nicky Cruz was born in San Juan, Puerto Rico in 1938. He was only eight years old when his heart turned to stone. His parents were deep into witchcraft and would perform seances and other spiritualist rituals. Nicky suffered severe physical and mental abuse at their hands. At one time, while in a spiritual trance, his mother declared that he was not her son, but the son of Satan. Hearing these words, he vowed as an eight-year-old boy to never love again, but to only feel hate. When he was 15, Nicky's father sent him to visit an older brother in New York City. Nicky didn't stay with his brother long. Instead, full of anger and rage, he chose to make it on his own. Tough, but lonely. By age 16, he became a member of the notorious Brooklyn street gang known as the Mau Mau's, named after a bloodthirsty African tribe. As callous and bloodthirsty as he had become, it only took six months for him to rise through the ranks to become their leader. As Cruz's reputation grew, so did his haunting nightmares. Lost in the cycle of drugs, alcohol, and brutal violence, he was arrested several times. A court-ordered psychiatrist pronounced Nikki's fate as headed to prison, the electric chair, and hell. Shortly after Cruz's ascension to leader of the gang, he encountered a skinny street preacher by the name of David Wilkerson. The preacher told Cruz that Jesus loved him and would never stop loving him. Shocked, Nikki responded by slapping Wilkerson and threatening to kill him. Wilkerson looked Nikki in the face and said that he could cut him into a thousand pieces but every piece would still say Jesus loves him. Two weeks later, Wilkerson had an evangelistic meeting in the neighborhood. When Cruz heard about it, he decided to go and teach the preacher a lesson. When he arrived at the arena, Wilkerson preached, then asked Nikki's gang to take up the offering. Nikki sprang to his feet and led a group of the gang through the crowd, insisting on people giving money. Going backstage, he saw an exit, but was struck by the fact that someone had actually trusted him he gave the money to Wilkerson on stage. Wilkerson's presentation of the gospel message and the love of Jesus melted the thick walls of Nikki's heart. When Wilkerson gave an altar call, Nikki responded and 25 of his gang followed him. Wilkerson prayed with Nikki and Nikki asked God to forgive him. Since the day he gave his heart to Christ, Nikki Cruz has traveled the world telling about the miraculous transformation that occurred in his life. Years after his conversion, Nikki created the Nikki Cruz Outreach, a team dedicated to reaching others with this message of God's love. From being declared the son of Satan to leading thousands to be children of God, Nikki Cruz continues to live out his dash, sharing the love of Christ.